What's up, y'all? Listen, this ain't gonna take long right here. I'm trying to figure out why you haven't got your hands on the book. Esoteric Secrets of the 48 Laws of Power or How to Use the Art of Seduction. Listen, I've made over 500 videos across four platforms. So many people ask me the question, how do I apply the art of seduction to my life? So I took it up on myself to make a guidebook of how to apply the art of seduction to your life. Now you might say to me, man, so many people don't read these books. Why do I need to read yours? For the same reason you can't list the 18 victim types divided by two and apply with the nine character types that'll give you two different strategic weapons to use for each character type depending on the victim that you're in front of. Or the same reason why you can't break down the 24 arts of seduction into the four phases of seduction and then come to understand that when I take the qualities of the anti-seducer, root those up out of me, I can then take those four phases, figure out where I'm at, apply one of the nine character types, don't even think about the victim types, and execute my plan according to where I'm at within the seduction. That's why. The esoteric secrets of the 48 laws of power went specifically into your birth chart, your time of birth, and how the 12 house, it's just funny how the 12 houses of the zodiac coincide with the 48 laws of power. You don't have to be into astrology. You don't have to be a person who go to tarot card readers. I'm just simply saying there is a undeniable essence behind the day you was born, the time you was born and where you was born. There is a undeniable correlation between the 12 houses your birthday and who you are today so i took it up on myself to do a deep dive a deep study and dive into the 48 laws of power then it started to click i say wow this law go at this house i studied further and dug deeper and came to the conclusion that the esoteric secrets of the 48 laws of power is a real thing And you still ask the question of why should I read your book? Because this is a book of application and not a book of just theory. If you don't understand emotional intelligence, you will not be a seducer of the highest order. You're so focused on your biceps. You're so focused on your tattoos. You're so focused on the length of your hair, the cologne that you spray, but you keep denying being vulnerable. You keep denying how to be available to someone emotionally. You keep denying those core parts of your being that will make you the top seducer because you don't understand emotional intelligence. And you still have the question of why should you read my book, right? Because in reading my book, you're going to understand that the correlation between the emotional intelligence, the art of seduction, the combination of the different aspects of the art of seduction, coupled with a little bit of self-esteem, topped off with some confidence and a very firm and strong foundation will make you the most ominous seducer around. And that's why you should read my book. It's your boy 50 Moves Ahead. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Listen, join my Patreon. The comments I receive across all platforms, I respond to on Patreon. You do not have to be a paid member. You don't have to be. Come to Patreon. I think you will like what you see. At 15 Moves Ahead. I'm out.